try to see if you guys have blood in there. That's good, that's good. Anyways, moving along. That, for some reason, reminds me of Blue Darius, my, uh, my good buddy from back in the day. Yeah, he was a good friend. He was a good friend, man. He was a good friend right up until that fucking swarm of a thousand bees fucking stung him all over his body. Oh, no. Killing him almost instantly. Poor guy. The next day. <laughs> Poor guy. Yeah. Anyway, this is uh, the last thing. The, this song's uh, title is the last thing I said to Lou before he was uh, before he was dragged to the ground by the swarm of bees, and that was uh, get into my car, get into my car, Lou. for Dr. Battle Smash, but also a switch for me because I have money. Yes, that's right. Uh, he made... Well, he didn't get sued, really, is what happened. He was an employee of mine at the kiosk when it burnt down, and there was a massive amount of lawsuits that happened after that, shortly after. And I wish not to speak about for illegal reasons. I can afford nice things like this 90s uh, $100 fender. People ask why I did not save Steve, the shark trainer. Let me just be clear that I tried my best. And to the extent of my capabilities, he was dead. We had to remove his head. I'm sure Dick can corroborate the story. He removed both of his shoulders first, and then he fucking took his head off. I don't know what the shoulders were for. It just spurted blood everywhere. It made a fucking just smoke. It made a goddamn huge mess. It was dead. Smoked shoulders. Haven't you ever heard of pulled human before? Anyways, this is about another shitty job. Medieval water delivery man would have been pretty bad, I think. Anyways, this song's about him, the unsung hero of the <laughs> Arctic. <laughs> 